Man, bro! <laughs> hey, man, it's your boy. Hey, KKA Young God coming to you live in the pink dungeon. Ah! Man, they get it to you real raw rugged, man. Hey, man, just always got to give it to you real raw rugged. But uh, we we are here with another review, reviewing here by Alicia Keys. You know what I'm saying, man? I was anticipating this because the first song that I heard from her this year was that. Look at you, look at you, look what you wanna do. How are you, how are you, what does it wanna do? We got way too much in common. If for me and honest with you. How could you love somebody like me? Why would you love somebody like me? If you could love somebody like me, you must be really messed up too. Man, that was fire, man. That was just like the, the beat, her vocals, crazy. I'm like, is she dropping something this year? Hey, she was, man. She was dropping here, and um, here's what I got to say about it. But before I get to it, you already know if you about to see by Pizza Hut, goddamn. Thank you. You know what I'm talking about? I try to rip it off. Shit ain't anywhere, man. <laughs> Let's get to it, man. The gospel, the first track, man. I don't know who allowed her, who told her that she can get on this uh beat, you know what I'm saying? Hey, man. But I don't know who gave her the fucking permission to pink slip. She got them. Whoa! She got them slipped and slide all over this thing right here, man. God, dog. She was... She, why she was spitting, man? She, what she said, uh, mama did the cooking, daddy did the yelling. Like, she was sliding all over this, man. Roaches in the rats, heroin in the crack. Ooh! Well, if you missing heroin with the crack, boy, you got that. What that is, a speedball? Hey, man. You be missing, if you mixing heroin with the crack, boy, hey, man, goddamn. You know, goddamn, rest in peace, man. Hey, man, you just don't care about life, do you, man? But if you got them, man, <laughs> nigga mixing, nigga mixing with the, the girl with the boy, hey, man. Hey, man, nigga mixing the Adam with the Eve. Hey, <laughs> hey, you a wild nigga, man. Um, hey, very good song right here, the gospel. She was spitting all over this. She was flowing better than some of the rappers do. Like, it was really good. Uh, Chat number two, though, Pawn It All. Hey, man, I love this. I would pawn you my watch. I would pawn you my chain. I would pawn you my golden diamond ring. Hey, man, I can hear Kendrick on a remix of this thing. I would pawn you my diamond watch. I could pawn you my diamond soul because I pawn me the. I, I can hear him doing that. I could the pawn but the diamond door. I sound like Yellow Wolf a little bit. Hey, but I can hear that nigga sliding all over this. Really good song right here. Um, hey man, shout out to Pawn Stars. Anybody watch Pawn Stars? Very good show, man. I'm not even talking about the little meme with uh Rick's. Hey, it's a very good show, man. I love Pawn Stars. <laughs> Channel number three, Kill Your Mama, man. Kill Your Mama is very good, man. Over an acoustic guitar. Um, she had a bar here. She said. Uh, she said, um, she said, uh, well, she, she said, if I were to, if we're so in love with hell, why the hell would heaven visit us? That was fire. You know, hey, that was, she was spitting over here, man. Like, her lyricism is crazy. I didn't know Alicia Keys' pin game was this retarded, man. Like, her shit, hey, here she gives a double thumbs up, man. It's really, really good. She don't really care slash one love. Now, this is one of the standout tracks on here to me, man. Um, hey, she don't really care. Got the diamonds in her air. She grew up in Harlem. She know she is a queen. Cause she grew up in Queens. She don't really care. This had that Jill Scott vibe to it. I, I feel like she was to a lot of Jill Scott when she made this song. Really good. But then it switched up to the second half, man. This shit is so hard that one love, one love. One love, one love, one love, one love, one love, one love. Very good song right here. This sound like some Fuji's right here, man. The way she was just doing that. One love, one love. Well, I, I went for Y Clef to one blood, <laughs> blood, blood. I was waiting for a nigga to come out and do that shit right there. It was all so hard. I could just imagine Y Clef on this. Then you put goddamn Lauren Hill, man. I'm telling you, man. This was. This was some Fuji type stuff right here. I really did enjoy this. Um, what you got? Chat number five. Illusion is bl illusion of bliss. This is probably one of the song of the year contenders for me, man. Um, this was a really good song. I'm telling you, man. This is at the end of the year. Like this should be on the songs of the year like list because this is a crazy song, man. The way she was just doing this right here. God damn, man. Illusion of bliss. She was singing and then she started crooning, man. Illusion of bliss. Like, she was just going off on here, man. And then you got the, um, I don't want to be a fallen angel, man. I don't want to be a fallen angel. I don't, dun, 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 
I don't want to be a falling angel. And then she, she kept going up another octave. She kept going up an octave. She couldn't, she couldn't go no more. Like, it was crazy, man. I don't want to be a fallen angel. Like, this is so good right here, man. But the first half, man, illusion of bliss. Dun, 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 dun. Like, just the church organ. Like, oh, my gosh. I'm telling you, this is one of the best songs of the year. This illusion of bliss. If you don't listen to any of this album, listen to, listen to illusion of bliss. It's crazy, man. Then it go to then the way that she transits to the second half of Lucifer Bliss to Fallen Angel. Well, I'm, I'm just making that track, but yeah, the way the fall. I don't want to be a fallen angel. The way she does that is so beautiful. The way she keep going up another octave, 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 octave. I'm telling you, man. And then the way the production is just switches. It's I'm telling you people, this is one of the best songs of 2016. Illusion of Bliss, the first half, is crazy, man. Like, the way that she goes, that she don't really care to Illusion of Bliss, one, two of the best songs on the album, is crazy, man. I don't want to be a fallen angel. The first half is ridiculous, though, man. It's, wow, man. The way she was just like, she was going off, man. It's it's crazy, man. I, I, I'm telling you, please listen to Illusion of Bliss. It's retarded. <laughs> Then what we got? Chat number six, uh, Blended Family. Um, this is a, this is a very pretty song. It's all I gotta say. It's very pretty. It's featuring ASAP Rocky. He has a very pretty verse. It was just a very pretty song. Love it. Uh, work on it, man. Uh, this sound like some, some oldie, some Eddie James that work on it, work on it, baby. I can imagine, like, this being an Eddie James, uh, Eddie James type song. This is really, really good. Very, very throwback. Uh, I was a fan of it. Um, very simple beat. Very good song, though. Uh, girl can't be herself. This is a pretty interesting song. She's basically talking about a girl trying to basically conform to what society thinks is cute. She said, I wish she said the Maybelline, hide all my insecurities, or something like that. Um, basically saying that you don't have to do all this to be cute, because you got to be yourself. And that's a fact. I've been telling girls all, all that time, man. If, you, if whatever you want, you know what I'm saying? Like, if, if you think... That no makeup is cute. Rock it. You know what I'm saying? Don't put on a face. Don't, don't goddamn beat your face. Because, hey, shit be looking nasty sometimes. Look like a nigga that goddamn really beat your face. You know what I'm saying? So, go with the natural look. You know what I'm saying? You see Queen Alicia rocking the natural look. You rock the natural too. You rock the natural look too, baby. You look fine with it. So, I really do enjoy her making this song. Basically throwing out. She said it make her sad when she see a girl that can't be herself. It made me sad too. You know what I'm saying? Like, girl trying to fit in. Even personality wise. But she was more talking physical looks wise. Hey, baby. Be you. Do, do, do you. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't, don't be with the action. It's be you and you and look cute. I like the message. Uh, then what we got next? What's the next song? All right, next song. Uh, More Than We Know. Uh, More Than We Know was a really, really good song. It's not like a hit right here, man. Uh, Baby, we can do. Like, it's a very good song. I'm very, like, <laughs> my throat really hurts. I can't sing right now. Uh, but it's a very good song. Uh, more Than We Know is more like a... I can hear her performing this at like live events with like a big crowd and they singing it with her. Very good song. I can see this being a smash. Um, where Do We Begin Now? Um, I don't know where every time I see Where Do We, I think of that uh, a song from Love and Hip Hop that... Where do we go from here? hate that song. But um, this is a really good song right here. It's a really good song. Then the transition to Holy War... Which is a very nice closure. It's very touching. Basically talking about just, uh, it, it just goes from a lot of places to talk about this versus this, this versus that, right versus, it's basically right versus wrong, moral sense. It's a really good song. And, um, hey man, that's the album. It's a really, really good album, man. I would advise everybody to listen to this. One of the best albums of 2016, if you ask me. It's one of my favorites, at least, and I really enjoyed it. And, um, until then, y'all already know, I say what I mean and I mean what I say. Hey, it's gonna hate him. Go play, holla at your boy, man.